Hey guys, Tempted Orange here, back for another video. This one is on Vehicle Simulator again. Sorry that it's been so long, I've had a lot of stuff to do last week, so... We're here now. <laughs> this, uh, the reason I didn't have a car out and I'm in here is because they released a new car. The Mitsubishi FPO GP. Now, I have a lot of money, like enough to buy this car. But, I'm just gonna test drive it, see how I like it. If I like it, maybe I'll buy it, give a nice review on, um, like, what I can get it to look like. Because I bet this car could get to look really good. Because it looks similar to the Supra, I think. So, let's get right into this vehicle. Where is it? Uh, Mitsubishi FTO. That's not a really good thumbnail, but... It does look a lot like the Supra. And it's kind of slow. It definitely works really well with the new chassis. The design is sleek. And it looks pretty good. So. Uh, top speed is stock. Oh, it's going. Flexing between 140 and 145. So I think we're good there at top speed for 145 miles per hour, that is. Um. Actually, we're going up. 150. Okay, stock top speed is 150. It looks like. Um, so yeah. Looks pretty cool. This car does look pretty cool. My hat sticks out of every single car. Basically. Oh yeah, there was a swap van remodel. Um, I'd show it off, but I do not have the SWAT game pass. Uh, let me see. Let's see. Does anyone have the SWAT game pass in my server? I'll ask them if I can see the new uh, SWAT van. They completely remodeled the SWAT van. Um, nobody's saying anything. Her. Up this road, I'm seeing to get slower speeds. Okay, this guy has it. Let's see. Can I see the remodel on them? Uh, maybe. <laughs> If he'd actually send something back. Is this him? No, Crispy Walks. Okay, he's basically paid win right here, I'm guessing. This car is pretty good. I really like the backfire. <laughs> I think that's something these cars are missing in this game. Backfiring. Really fun. And actually hilarious. Actually, I wonder if any cars, other, other cars do actually have backfire. I'm pretty sure they do. And I'm just dumb. Like, I'm pretty sure my Zonda has it. Oh god, this is so bad. Whoops. Alright, it's a bit quieter now. Oh. But, it does seem to be backfiring, so let's check out Agera. Maybe Agera has it too. Let's see. Second gear. Third gear. Fourth gear. Yeah, it has it. Well, I'm just dumb. They all have it, I'm guessing. Uh, extreme backfire confirmed. Is my boost working? And the backfire is just messing it. What? This thing has seven gears. Sick. I actually didn't know that this thing had seven gears. Okay, this guy doesn't seem like he's showing me the uh, remodel, so. Oh. Let's uh, spawn my Tesla Roadster 1. I haven't been playing this game much, but if I did play it more, 
I would definitely be saving up for the Tesla Roadster 2.0. Because this car already is insane. Oh god, that Tesla Roadster had a really bad time. Did they nerf it? I never heard of a nerf. Huh. Well then, if I don't get my usual time with this car, it's either my new network adapter or they nerf the car. There isn't a Goisto over there, but there's a guy in it. Otherwise, I'd steal it. Oh, that's my friend. Oh, wait, no, it's not. He looked kind of like a police officer from where I was. Oh, I think, they, I think he's stock. That's why. Basically stock. Alright, full speed. Ludicrous mode. Go, 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 go. Oh. Nope. Uh, I'm taking that it was nerfed right now. Uh, let me check their page. Well, did they nerf the car? Tons of bug fixes, including insanity fixes. Improve reverse to forward. I didn't realize anything different about it, so... Alright, let me test my Agera against it. See if Tesla was nerfed on other cars were buffed to help with this drag issue. Actually... Oh, nope, the wheel stopped spinning at the very end. Will the Agera pull forward? Huh... I have a feeling that the Tesla was nerfed. Oh god, what has he done to me? So, hopefully, if I just launch this car correctly, I can get a time under six again. Like, Tesla doesn't have problems with bad launches. Because it's got the four-wheel drive. Oh, uh, no, back off. Wait, that's my friend again. This is my... Oh, god. What the? Is someone playing a loud ringing? And that's not just me. Okay, that's a good launch. Um. Okay, 6.4. Hmm. Now I wonder. Because I maxed my Tesla completely. Hmm. Can I launch it so well? Oh, test driver. That thing will blow us all the way. Alright. Come on, Tesla. Holy crap, that GTR is keeping up. Tesla was definitely nerfed. Like, a lot. It's still all wheel drive, but it's definitely nerfed. Um. I wonder. Did he go through with the upgrades I actually recommended? That would be sick if I if he went through with my upgrades. Uh, someone hates the Tesla nerf. I love it, actually. Uh, it does not look like he went through with it. There's no way to change our drivetrain. Well, that sucks. I guess the 2.0 is. Still a way to go. Did my test drive end for the Mitsubishi yet? No. So, oh god, okay, I'll take this thing around the map, I guess. I'll test it out on ramps and bumps, depending on how much time. 
I rented it at basically the start of the video, so I say I have about two minutes left. Yeah, it handles bumps pretty well, it seems. But that is, this is not upgraded, so. But yeah, it is going over bumps well. So there's nothing wrong with the suspension on this car. It drifts well. This might be a Supra competitor, so. That might be good. Because now the Supra won't destroy everyone. Through the drift battles. This thing's got it. And there we go. But the Toyota A86. AE86 is still probably one of the best drift cars in this game. Even though mine is complete ricer. Oh, yep. This is still one of the best drift cars in the game. My spoiler is coming off the end of the car. Like, whoa, what am I gonna do about that? They need to either widen the back of this car or make it so the spoilers fit each car. Now this car is not close to maxed, and it's still really slow, but it does accelerate. Like, it has enough power to accelerate pretty well, actually. Oh, I have my Model S that drifts. Yeah, I'll see. I'll also say I have an AE86 because this thing is pretty good uh, drift car. Oh, drift competition. Drift competition. Dodge. What dodge? Uh, the charger? Oh god, he's using the charger. The charger comes off the ground if he uses his boost. So, he's only going to be good on the straights and not really drifting. That is if he tries to use his boost through the drifts. Um... Uh, lag. Hi. And there he is on his Dodge Charger. That's not gonna really go that well around these corners. I don't know, I never really tr All right, just a slight interruption there. <laughs> okay, got to win this drift challenge. That didn't even count as a drift. Oh God. Why aren't my drifts counting? The heck? Um... All right, that's a good jump. Okay, then. Uh, 
Um, what the heck? My none of my drifts counted. Really. That's it. That's, there's some scrape. There's donuts. Okay then. Um. If. Let's see if he wants a rematch. Am I gonna disconnect? What the heck? No, we can. Um, what? No, we can't, or no, we can. Oh, I've won. Oh, there's a Mitsubishi in here now. And he brought his other car. And back in the charger. Here, I'll drop out of this ring. Okay, he's back in the ring. Alright, this is the final race before I end the video, so this should be good. Alright, I'm already at 67. And that one didn't count, what the heck. Okay, there we go. 97. That one also didn't count. Why are they not counting? I have to come to a complete stop and then go again? What the heck is going on? Oh. Okay, we're back. And my drifts are counting. Oh god, what is he doing to me? Drift one point. What if I just do some donuts? Oh, they're counting. This is counting as a drift. That's a lot of drift points. I'm gonna rack this up until it's at about 5 seconds and then go hit that checkpoint. There we go. Ow. I'm stuck. There we go. Come on. Count as a drift. Count as a drift. There we go. Ah, come on. Oh, there we are. That's a nice score. I'm kind of sad that my drifts weren't counting, though. I think that's a record high for me. Alright, um, let's see what he hits on this. Hopefully it's not a sigh. What? then I'll learn how to do that but I guess this has been the end of this video this has been tempted orange and I'll see ya